Hello Year 10 parents and carers, I hope you're all well and staying safe. As the return to school approaches, I've put together a PowerPoint to go through what our first week back is going to look like and hopefully answer any questions or concerns that you may have. I hope you're excited to get back to school as we are and we look forward to seeing you very soon. If you have any questions or queries, please don't hesitate to contact me at year 10 at trafaris.net. Take care for now and see you very soon. Take care, Year 10. Bye. As you're aware, the first day back for Year 10 is Tuesday the 9th of March. This week, you will receive a letter telling you what time to arrive at school. Your arrival time will be dependent on your form group. However, if you arrive by bus, you come in at the normal time. Please remember, buses are running as usual, but you must wear a face covering whilst travelling on the bus. When you arrive, you must go directly to either the key or the main hall, dependent on your form group. Please refer to the letter sent this week. As you're aware, you need to be tested on your return to school. So once you arrive at school, you go directly to the key hall and you need to wait, socially distanced and wearing a face covering. A face covering needs to be worn at all times inside the school building. The test is nothing to be worried about. It's a quick swab at the back of your throat and up your nose and over and done. The test then will take about 30 minutes. You need to wait for a negative test result before going to your lesson. Whilst waiting, you must remain socially distanced and wear your face covering. You will be tested over three times during the first three weeks at school. After that, you'll then test yourself at home. Parents and carers, just a quick reminder to make sure that you have completed the parental consent form for testing of your child. There is also a video on our school website that you can watch if you're nervous about the test. Once you've received a negative test, you can go to your lessons. But please remember, we have changed the classrooms in which you have some of your lessons in. New timetables will be handed out once you arrive. Travelling around school is exactly the same as it was before Christmas. You need to continue to follow the one-way system, sanitising our hands on entrance to the quay and the main building, and also when entering and leaving classrooms. Now, as the classrooms have changed, we need to make sure that we wipe down our chair and table at the end of the lesson. Please remember to wash your hands at break and lunch times. And now face coverings must be worn at all times when you're inside the school building. This means you need to be wearing your face coverings during your lessons, as well as when moving around the school. In preparation for the return to school, it's time to find and dust off that uniform. Make sure you know where that tie is. Remember our uniform expectations and make sure our hair, nails and piercings follow the correct guidance. Year 10 PE is still on a Wednesday and students will still come to school in their PE kit. But can I remind you that PE kit means that we need a NT PE hoodie or t-shirt with your blazer. If you need any help with uniform or PE kit, please get in contact and let us know because we can help. The year 10 timings of the school day are exactly the same. They haven't changed. So we have form time from 8.35 till 9, lesson one is still 9 till 10, then we have our break, lesson two from 10.20 to 11.20, then lesson three, lunch is at 12.20 to 12.55, and then lesson four and five. This week, you will be completing a student voice questionnaire. This is to help us identify any of you that are worried or concerned about the return to school. We know lockdown has been difficult on all of us, and we just want to make sure that the right support is in place for you. Please talk to your form tutors, Mrs Pender, myself or even Mrs Cartwright. If you're worried or concerned or anxious about anything, we're here to help. The first week back is going to be a busy one. So on Monday the 15th of March, we are going to have an extended form time. During this time, we're going to have a virtual assembly to give out information, answer any questions and conduct some student interviews based on the questionnaires you filled out. We can't wait to see you all. Take care and we'll see you on Tuesday the 9th.